Don't let like who we think is better ruffle your feathers. Opinions are like assholes, or assholes are like podcasts. Everybody, Everybody has one. one. How y'all doing today? I'm doing it a little bit differently because I'm light skinned. We're going to start from the right and work our way to the left. In Type it. Nigga. So, <laughs> Black Jesus, how you doing, sir? Hey, how you doing? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, God got, bless y'all. Next to him, we got the brain, Nino. What's going on? Hey. Nice to hear it from you. You ain't do your ad lib. That's crazy. Tight nigga. So <laughs> doing something different. Every, every, every is week. You heard from me. week to week, something different. Introducing the B microphone this week. My Ooh. nigga, Big O, and I ain't talking Oscar Robinson, Scrooge, O Block. Uh huh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And then you know me, none other. You know me, C D and Bezo. And on to my <laughs> man. Mr. Shoot the Fade. Yo. Cut different network MVP. Damn. Yes, sir. And then I got straight shot, no chaser. Damn. Brandy B. Diddy Danielle. No, Diddy. Y'all know what it is. Yeah, Diddy. Y'all know what it is. Take that, take that, take that. (laughs) But not least, we got Chuck in the back with the facts. Hey, hey, hey. So look, man, I need some, need y'all to give it up and make some noise for your boys. Hello there. Yeah, yeah. You know what's going on. Hey, one time for my sister Brandy. Let's go. One time. Enough of that. Enough of that. We're going to um, give a comp- moment of silence for the competition. Mm. Okay. Damn, I forgot that. That's what we into. We the ones. All right, man. Fuck them. That. Fuck y'all. Enough of that. All right, man. So before we get cracking into the topics, I just want to ask y'all because we're doing things differently. Anybody got anything they want to talk about that they doing or got going on before we get it cracking? I quit my motherfucking job. Fuck that job. Hey. Fuck them. <laughs> He said, screw you guys. Boy, we I'm going to, home. Self-made, self-paid. The more I thought about it, I just felt like it was some illegal shit going down. How y'all got me working nine hours a day, mm-hmm. a 25-minute lunch break, Ooh. and y'all want me to work Saturdays? Oh, uh, yeah. Fuck y'all. He said... He said, if you cut the, he said if you it cut off that 10-minute break, that 45-minute break, and that 15-minute nah, break, it wasn't, he it said, it I should no, be out this bitch no by 2.30 every afternoon. It was 120, <laughs> it's 1.25. <125. laughs> That's nah. it. Teams are not nah. 1.25. He said it. if a frog had a glass nah. ass with a break every time it moved. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, go. I just want to tell you, man, it, a 25-minute break sounds nice because nah. in my profession, what's a break? Dude, Nigga, you get to eat the chicken as you cook nah, it. What no. the fuck? You too. Well, that sounds like some fuck? common You too. You so, chose to be a manager and, and to be a higher up. As soon as you put, put your food here. in that microwave you for lunch a, break, you and then to get out, you eat you it. Want. You're back out Once there on the land. Once I get fully staffed, and that store burned down. Once I get fully staffed, you could take as many breaks <laughs> as you like. But you know what? Since yeah. y'all speaking about jobs, <laughs> talk about it. Let's talk about it. I got an interview on Monday. Let me go. Okay. Okay. No, you know. Okay. More money. More money. So, wish me luck. Wish me luck. I ain't gonna lie. Yes. Already got it. Good. I just gotta make sure the drug test. Hey, is it My urine? It's not a it's not a test more. I can't pass as long as I got time to study. You heard? That's all I'm saying. That's me. Well, if, if that's all that's going on with my brothers and sisters, then it allow me to jump straight in it, man. And we going it's it's a little bit heavier than how we started off, man. I want to talk about Sonya Massey. Mm. Mm. Dying. Mm-mm. Yeah. Um, Chuck, say her name. Say her name. Chuck, I don't want you to run the video. Of what's going on? I dinner do. Nah, because uh, YouTube. Yeah, it might be yeah. a little, you know, disclaimer. It's, where it's all for educational but purposes. We could, we could most definitely run the audio clip. Bro, I could probably show the video and then just do it like the news does. If like a blur. Okay. Or, okay. Or, or a slight or blur on it. Like just pause the video and let the audio even play out. Even yeah. Got you. Yeah. Disclaimer for this footage. And again, this is all educational purposes. This is for educational purposes. Mm-hmm. What she said. He that made things so much easier. I, I just need just driver's license will do. And now I get out of your hair. I want to show y'all my paperwork. I will what? get your paperwork. What paperwork? Okay. I got some paperwork. Well, just get your ID. Well, let's get your ID attention. first and then. One task at a time here. Okay. Here, grab your ID for me. Uh-huh. Okay. Your ID. One task at a time. So let's do an ID. 
And then you can dig around for your uh, paperwork. I don't know where my ID is. You can yeah. that stack right there, maybe? One second. Just check on her. Let me this. No, we don't need a fire while we're here. Right. Right. Oh, where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? Uh, away from your hot steaming water. Away from my hot steaming water? Yeah. Oh, I'll rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I'll rebuke you in the name of Jesus. You better fucking not. I swear to God, I'll fucking shoot you right in your fucking face. Yep, and it cuts off right there. No, it don't. Just for just for calling on the name of Jesus? <laughs> Lord, for rebuking. Just, yeah. I thought man. about that part. That's rebuking the devil. Yeah, you I call it on the name of Jesus. You know what I mean? Like, I thought about that part too. Like that—that that made me feel mm -hmm. some spiritual type of vibe right there. Cause so that so demon was got extended, on, You better not. In the extended video, they actually showed him shoot her. Though, yeah, right. Yeah. They sh yeah, she gets shot three times: two She's in the, the face, one in the chest. You hear her say, "I'm sorry, I'm sorry," and get down, and he's still. Yeah. You feel me? And they—they they killed that woman in cold blood. I'm. <clears throat> And to start off, like, let me let me walk it down yes, a little bit further. Go ahead, go ahead. So how this starts all off because she says that she saw somebody in her window, like on some peeping Tom shit. So she calls talking about an intruder <coughs> and stalking her. And then you, that was her interaction with police when they got to her apartment. Yeah, that's fair. For one, this just shows <laughs> the everyday trials and struggles, not just black men, but black women or people of color have when it comes to law enforcement um no matter how many steps we may take to go forward it's going to be one ignorant motherfucker who's going to go global who's going to go viral that's going to fuck up the narrative again for everybody so we this is for every 10 to every 10 steps that we take forward that's another 20 30 that we're going to take back and speaking of fucking up the narrative bro <clears throat> They done went and told her pops mm -hmm. all kind of shit. They did. You know what I'm saying? But the truth. They you know what I'm saying? They tried to say to that the it was self-inflicted. Yeah, they tried to say. Uh, to the coroner was like, how? It, when it's three bullet wounds. It's three wounds. Mm -hmm. How did she do that to herself three times when the first yeah. one killed her? First, they, they, that, was, that was one of the rumors. That, you know what I'm saying? One of the uh, uh, speculations that they brought up that she could have done it to herself. Then they going to say, oh, it was the intruder that did it. You know what I'm saying? What intruder? Sure you know what I mean? Like. They did like, like yeah, just kept yeah, making shit up. Just kept making shit up. And the uh, pops like, man, I ain't. They never told me. You know what I'm saying? That the officers had anything to do with this. You know what I'm saying? Out of out of all the out of all the things that were Why? said. You know because what I'm saying? Because they going they gonna protect their own when it comes to certain exactly. shit. And, and it shows. Exactly. But they do that every time. They prove that yeah. shit every time. For it, shit, it's sure. not one case that has <laughs> been public <clears throat> that has been national when it has come to some type of police and civilian brutality or murders or whatever mm. and they that's what they do bro they cover for each other they try to <laughs> until it's to the point to where they can't yeah. yeah so now that this body cam is out here they can't cover for him that's messed up man they can't cover for him but the but i'm gonna say this though I uh i saw mugs on a on a i see a mugs out of him i haven't I but I'm, I'm I'm gonna say this because I had this conversation kind of like earlier with somebody, right? And I, I'm spiritual, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna say this. She rebuked. I was thinking that the Go ahead, evilness. Screw. Go ahead, screw. right? Mm -hmm. Cook. Jesus said that they're gonna persecute you. They're gonna persecute you. They persecuted me. They killed me. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So anybody who believes in me or who's going to follow me is going to suffer and go through the same exact thing. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I feel like she her life, that her, 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 her life had purpose. This is something's about to stir and brew from this. Mm -hmm. As any other situation, at some point you think it's like a breaking point or we feel like we got over a hump. Mm -hmm. Certain, it's going to be one situation, but it's going to happen. And if this ain't it. Like a spiritual warfare, and this is gonna snap. Uh, it's gonna snap everybody's <laughs> mentality or how we act or how we treat police officers. It's gonna. It's gonna be a lash out, this, and, this, and it's gonna be a, to a point to yeah. where it's, it's gonna be like, "Fuck y'all, we ain't on this, and we yeah. on that." Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so now that you talk about that, well, can I get my how, perspective of what I, I felt? Be, that's just how I believe. Go ahead, walk it down. So I'm gonna get my perspective from, and then I want to hear from Nino after <clears> you. Go ahead. From the whole thing, so um, I took it from two different perspectives, like watching the whole footage and everything. I had to watch it like ten times because my stomach was just turned. Like, what did she do wrong? Like, what sudden moves did she make? What did she say? All of that, like, it it just didn't make sense to me. She's calling about an intruder. Y'all come in. And y'all giving her these orders about getting her ID and everything, but y'all also talking about, well, I want you to get the hot water so it don't make a fire. She goes over there. You talking about, I'm going to shoot you in your fucking face. First of all, sir, where, that's why I feel you, Scrooge, about the 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 demon and, and the spiritual part of it. Because like mm-hmm. when she said, I rebuke you, like did it just like channel something for it to come up out of him? Mm-hmm. You better Come not, on, or I'm going to shoot a boiling you. Hot, not. You feel like a boiling pot of water, Al Green, so have some goddamn boiling grits. You can dodge some water, sir, but also with me graduating with my criminal justice uh, degree, <coughs> we know that that's deadly force that you did. On, with, with that situation, you don't need deadly, fir- uh, deadly force. Mm-hmm. You could have used a taser. You mm-hmm. feel me? But he was never a threat. She was that that situation was not even a threat. You already made it clear yeah. that when you said I'll shoot you in your fucking face, so like you made wrong. it, you feel me? He was wrong either way. The whole he situation. Out a taser. He and was when the she, when he, the you know, <laughs> he came at her aggressive. That's when you see her throw her hands up and say, "I'm sorry, I'm sorry," and you still shoot her point blank face, uh, point blank in her face. Well, you sitting there and you asking, "What is his reason? What did she do?" Tell me a time in history when hate needed an excuse. Period. Feel that. Mm-hmm. Now, my my, my, my for, second... Go ahead, and I'm going to finish. No, what I was about to say is for every person that's, that got love for us, like Chuck, is going to be somebody else that hates you for no reason and looking for a reason. And, yeah. and any excuse is a good enough excuse to do what he did to her. Yeah. It ain't nothing that we ain't never seen before. It ain't nothing that we not yeah. going to never not see again. It's uh, I get to the point where I don't even really start watching that shit anymore because it's... It's all the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude going to get, they going to make up an excuse for this motherfucker. They going to fire him. He going to move to another district. Ain't no way he can get it. He going to get hired as another police officer somewhere else. Mm -hmm. And he going to go on about his business. Ain't no way he can get an excuse for this. When it's it's time for the people to stand up. But my, my second perspective of it, I looked at her age. She's the same age as me. She's a woman just like me. I just had an incident like this that happened to me not too long ago, like two weeks ago, where some drunk, high old man came to my door like banging at 12, 31 o'clock talking about uh, this is his home. Let me in. You owe me some money. Thank God Russell was there. Well, he was coming off his shift and he handled it. But it makes me scared to call the police now. Not for sure. Mm-hmm. It made me scared to call the police. That, that nigga was trying to intrude into my house. It made me want to start and taking had things. Had he been my- gone when they got there, they would have treated you like her. Possibly, you never know. Not saying that all cops are like that, but I'm just saying that type of stuff scares me you now. To know. where I only, I rather take it into my own hands. How about For that? Sure. Hey, I wanted to touch on what Nino said. How um, the cops just gonna get fired and move to another state and get another cop job? Mm-hmm. He has been fired six times. Wow, you know what I'm saying? six times, and relocated every time. And, see, mm-hmm. and you ain't got no. You know what That's saying? crazy, bro. You can't blame you for, just for being afraid. Yeah, it's like, see, and then people, people wonder why we say, like, fuck the police because they are really above the law because how can you investigate yourself? Or they win you every have, time. You got to have more schooling and training to be a beautician than to, be, than a to be a cop. Officer. Exactly. Mm. She ain't not no more. Mm. Not no more. They are begging people here in Dayton to, to just come down you don't even. Have, I thought I had to have a, a nah. degree for that shit. No, not no more. For what? Not no more. To not be a police, a police officer. officer. Yeah, well, that's, that's what he's saying. You gotta have no point, degree right. now. That's the point. That's I'm what he's saying. Oh, okay. You gotta. They, it's you easier, gotta go through more. It's easier to be a be uh, to be a police officer than to be oh, a yeah, truck my driver. My but they're not paying them motherfuckers. Shit, exactly. They're not. That's but why they begging. It ain't nobody. Yeah. They're not paying them motherfuckers nothing. But but if you think about it. Why not sign up for that shitty pay? Because you above the law. You get to really go do what you want as long as you don't get caught. Even when you do get caught. You yeah, they got your man. back. Exactly. Man, Until they don't, It's though. still a stressful job. Shit, when, when don't they? When six times is like, crazy. Six times is insane. That is <laughs> diabolical. But, 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 but this is what I'm saying, though. But, think about it. Mm. Now, now, think about it. We we had your back up until this point. Now you done crossed the line. There is nothing that... 
Think about it. So the whole situation with the George Floyd situation. We right? don't know. We don't know what dude got charged for the other six times, the other five times. We don't. But we're. I'm. Sh- he could have did this before. Could have. But this is the difference. This is viral. So if they was able to cover up before, you can't cover this one. But how many times have a police officer did some shit like this and this shit, the same <laughs> type of shit happened? They, they're they going to forget all be, about it, I'm bro. I'm saying That's it's going to be somebody different every time, bro, because this, uh, this has been... Or it could be the one. same motherfucker six times. He gonna, he gonna get this work. Nah. Just say it. Like, he gonna get this work. Example of this work. I think this time Here's he's gonna get thing. this work. I, I wanna, Derek Chauvin was like one example. I now wanna, that's that's we ain't going. That's what I'm said. trying to explain. That's what I'm. That's what I, that was my point. I hate to say it. It took some people to die bef- a, a minute ago for it to lead up to this, but I mean, it hey, took no, some. See, Here's the thing. I want to touch on something that you said because you was like, we got to start fighting back. We got to stand up. Like, there was a cop. In the city that just killed a little boy a couple weeks ago. I want to yeah. say two weeks ago. Like, mm-hmm. man, listen. Shout out to my little they done, Juice. RIP. Mm. And listen, we don't got no no community, no leaders that's rallying us. Because, like, for real, we should have burnt down his department. Should have burnt mm-hmm. that nigga's house down. Exactly. Ooh, house car, down, all his mom, shit. all that shit. I ain't even, I, I apologize, bro, because, listen, I be so caught up in my shit, bro. I don't even watch the news. It's depressing. Sometimes, well, I, well, find, you, sometimes you know. I be finding out shit the day of. I went to well, my little cousin's funeral the details. day I found out first. of it. You know, it's crazy. I be wanting you know, know what I'm saying? Like, first. I be so caught up, bro. So it be, I didn't know that. But it's just so, it's, it's fucked up, bro. That's how life be lifing. Listen. You know what I'm saying? My my life is in fucking national news, nigga. You feel what I'm saying? I go because of what everybody else going through and what everybody dealing with. So I, I really don't got time to be trying to tune in with everybody else's situation when I got shit that I got to focus and worry about. But that's a fucked up situation, bro. You got to be aware, gotta though, be, bro, because that's I'm part aware. of the problem. No, I'm aware. It's not that I'm not aware. I know what's it's going on around that, me. Yeah, I about to say shit that like that can get swept under the rug if you just in the daily routine of your everyday thing. And it's like, you know, I ain't got time to stop and listen to the news and look around you. I, mean, that's, I feel like that's how this got out of hand. Like, just not enough people give a fuck. Nobody's willing to sacrifice nothing because, I mean, we ain't had a real leader since what? Malcolm X? Yeah, been Khalid. In. That's crazy. We had a couple of them. Hey, I'm about to say what well, now. Nah, let me not talk about the yeah, success is like the '60s, '70s. So he's right. Tuki and them, '80s. Yeah, yeah. Tuki and them. They killed Tuki though. I know. Yeah. He was in prison. Same when story he... as Malcolm. Well, not same, but I about to, no, I about to say, not same. Practically, if you will. <laughs> They don't want to let Larry Hoover out. They gonna been that man. That man been man. in jail like forty five. Because you know why? Years, bro. It ain't a black man. Ain't a black man that ain't gonna have something to listen to him. What? Larry Hoover out and he talking about he about to direct some shit. Oh yeah, we moving real, real um militant. We still got fair kind. Yeah. Yeah. All still right. got fair kind. But what I'm saying I'll though is that. like shit like this can't But we don't need that's and the we problem. Just keep going right back to living every day. That's life. the problem. Black people, we don't need one leader. We need multiple, multiple. leaders. Can I, can I be honest? We don't need one leader because every time one leader get a assassinated whatever it seemed like it sets us back 20 more steps backwards we know we need exactly. more than one leader so that also too when they trying to infiltrate your stuff like uh uh hoover back in the fbi days they don't know which one to target first because there's too many of us it's and we many. all coming on strong we don't need one leader dr umar no 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 <laughs> brother polite <laughs> hell no, uh, no yeah no, I just no. but the thing like, see, but the, the issue is it, I, if we have a lack of leadership and nobody wants to be the one to step up to do it. Because black folks been taught about a messiah all their life because of a Bible. Ooh. Stop waiting cook. on a messiah. See, hold on. Time on. Don't time out. 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 <coughs> we ain't gonna sit here and keep trying to blame that because guess what? I've That's been told about. Is. I've been told about a messiah. But if we gonna go by scripture, it was God make man in our image? I'm a God too. What you talking about? He gave me. He gave me certain abilities. And I'm a, I'm so a either God utilize, too. either utilize them. Or find something else to uh, blame but it on. Black folks you been can't programmed. Do that. You can't. We all been to wait on a messiah due to no, that Bible no, that the colonizers brought no, to us. We, we're, not, okay. we're not about to do that. Mm. Okay. Do, that. do you research, screw? I've done do research. research baby. I've done research. And they not, surprised. We huh? know. We know. Dude, on his way back. The first one but of the first slave we, ships over here was called Jesus. I'm, mm-hmm. And that's fine too. 
But regardless, mm. everything you saying is manipulation. So no, I ain't manipulation. That's, that's what they taught you. That's, that's, no, that is that, manipulation. They I mean, reverse psychology. Right. That's yeah. manipulation. You, baby, you, you, right. Y'all they saying manipulated the same thing you. They use something right, for mic, that. One mic, one mic, one mic, one mic. That's manipulation, right baby. If I use something for the benefit all of right, my game. Right, hey, you know what, Screws? Hold on, hold on. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna leave that there. Because I feel like we could go on this for hours. Okay. That's that on that. That's that on that. Cause I, hey, look, we gonna switch it up, man. Can we talk crazy. a little? Yeah, can we talk yeah. a little bit of politics? What's Go up, B? Let's talk about it. Hey, my nigga, uh, Joe Byron said I'm done. He J, he J Cole. I heard he man. did. Go. I heard he secretly did somewhere. Damn, that's dead fucked for up. Days. I was just about to say go ahead and go to bed, but damn. damn. <laughs> Wake up, Joe. Go, go ahead and go to bed, Joe. Joe Biden dead, for real. You heard he dead. Don't say that's he dead. Up. Put it in the group. <laughs> I, I see what this segment is about to be. I wasn't going to say go to bed. He's dead. Go to bed. <laughs> no. No. Hey, man. Mm -mm. I ain't a part of that, but, uh, I don't. I don't blame... Uh, I don't blame Joseph. these guys for going here and sitting him down, man. It's it's been too much. Uh, Joe had to go. It's been too much dosey dose going up on. You know what I mean? Like he tired. He, he can't keep up with the conversation. He said, "Jesus, take the wheel." Whatever he's talking about, he, he just he got dementia. Yeah, I, I think allegedly. So. Yeah, it's over with for dude. It's over for yeah. dude. It's so, like I ain't but, a doctor. What's up with Camilla though? Because we ain't seen mm. her. And God knows mm. how long. Since we did it, Joe. What? what? I ain't heard her speak at long all. Four years ago. I don't know if she ready, man. Hopefully she got a game plan together while she been Listen, under wraps so, or something. So I stand corrected on some things when it comes to Kamala. Yeah. So I got to bring this to the, I got to bring this. It was something on Facebook, but I had tagged your name. In I it. saw that. Did you see that? I did. So... Do you want to enlight on that? No, nah, go ahead, okay. walk it down. So, there are things that Kamala did that I didn't know about, mm -hmm. wasn't aware of. I didn't even know this existed. Mm -hmm. um, but we get caught up in media because media controls information, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So they always gonna make the image or portray to make it seem like a person ain't shit or whatever. True. Make a long story short. Kamala is responsible for a program that was meant for offenders um, pertaining to the marijuana uh, charges and uh, being incarcerated and all that for when they, uh, it was to either reduce. It's called the Back on Track program. Hmm. She uh, did it in 2005. And that was in 2005. Nobody, but we didn't, I didn't know that. Of course, it was a different... It was a whole... You know what I'm saying? She so, got it written into the penal code for California. So, it's a lot of things that she... Uh, it's a it's something else that in the video dude was talking about. So, yeah, it's a bunch of work in oh, like uh, prison reform. And uh -huh. very positive. And it's been done, like, years ago. Okay. Way and, before we... Even and I would like to elaborate on why you didn't hear about a lot of this. Because we had a Republican running the country at the time. And she's a Democrat. And she's doing Democratic things. When they when she started doing for her pushes for prison reform, they were saying that you can't do that and be a DA. Mm -hmm. Because you're, you're soft on crime. Mm -hmm. When she's like, man, people don't need punishment. They need rehab yeah. most of the time. So even though... She, even, Even though, though, like, we, yeah, true, we had a Republican running the country. But Very most of, majority of the time, MSNBC is shed light on the Democratic Party. You know what I'm saying? Uh, whether good or bad, really. Like, you know, and then CNN, they kind of, like, more so cover the Republican. You're not wrong, right? Side of but the, dig this. Remember, when it, Trump was in office, everybody spent their whole time just, like, the Russian collusion, the, the the fucking porn star he paid off. Like, you know yeah, what I mean? They yeah. had a bunch of bullshit to talk about for Rush to keep you from hearing about some shit you might want to know. Got you. <clears throat> How did this go over everybody's heads for so long? Because people really don't have too much good to say about is it Kamala? <laughs> it's Kamala. Okay. Kamala Harris. Mm hmm Because one of y'all called her Calamine or some I shit said, like I'm that. I, I said Kamala. Go. It's, it's, it's Kamala. I wouldn't go. I wouldn't go. Kamala Khan. I wouldn't go. I said it's, Kamala. It's, it's Kamala. <laughs> thought, it's, it's Kamala, Kamala Khan? It's, it's Kamala Harris. Okay, okay. well. Kamala Khan. It's Kamala. Get, <laughs> get her name right. Kamala, 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 get her name Kamala, right. Kamala, 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 Kamala. I might not agree with everything put she's done in the past, but put some respect on her name. Okay, so. some respect on her? Yeah, because y'all know how to say Trump. 
How did all the stuff? You. She'll be all right. Let's see her say Diarco. That's one. Well, go ahead, bro. How did how did we let Chanchala Harris do all this great stuff? <laughs> the child <is> great. And <laughs> it went over our heads to where we never heard about this. <clears throat> heard about what? About all the prison about reform and all the good shit. Reform. Because they How made it seem like that? you did. Why didn't you say anything about it when we I was spoke about it? On the I was other like, episode? yeah. Yeah, I know about. That's why I said it's some things that I know about her that I don't agree with. Like some what? of her well, with this her, her being an attorney and like you see, know, see all the stuff that you about to mention is all the shit that they ever yeah. highlighted for me to even have any type of opinion. I, know. I ain't know nothing about the prison reform. Y'all shit gotta pay attention that. to that shit. That's why. I mean, but like you I said, heard, they put she, a lot of shit in I our face. She was to out make here this. locking brothers up. I ain't that's what I heard the, too. And that's the what I, reform see, that's what I'm saying. She so was. She started. That like she, was. she got to where she was at. Mm, okay. You don't get to be. You don't go DA to vice president by not locking it. She was. Yeah. But yeah. guess what? But guess what? Also, what is the prosecutor's job to do? Once she got. What is the prosecutor's job to do? One mic. One mic. Once. Once you. She got talking. You right. Damn. I'm, go I'm ahead, go ahead. As they ask a question, okay. So once she got to a political level, it only made sense for her to come up with prison reform and so and what so so she can get more. You feel me? Now I'm presidential candidate. I can use this as talking points when I tell you why you should vote for me. Doesn't it all make sense now? Mm-hmm. So is she really just a crook playing a good guy now because she wants to get you know in the higher ups, or do she really is she really for the people? Man, I don't it's know. Like, it's a uh, it's all a politician game. I don't uh, trust no politician. <clears throat> period. It's all yeah. a politician game. But like I said, I don't agree with some of the things she's done in the past. But how can we play that question that you just said? Is she a crook trying to play this when she's going against Donald Trump? But she's a politician. One of the he's, biggest. He, I, he's a politician now too. Apparently, well, he was yeah. president. So how can we question her well, antics and live his antics what, too? What's the difference between a crooked businessman and a politician? There is none. The di- so the, the, we the can't question. We can't question. So what? We, we supposed to make vote it for her because she, she a woman? I never said nothing about her being a woman. I'm just asking. Can I ask you a question? I didn't say nothing about her being a woman. Can I what ask you? Woman? Can I ask you I'm a question, saying, Brandon? No, we supposed to vote for I her. I didn't even get a chance to tell you what I was going to say about her. You're going against Trump. That's why we supposed to vote for her, right? Anybody but Trump. No, I was bringing That's up the obvious. fact when he asked, when he said that about her, like, is she playing Anybody. this and playing that? This is politics, like uh, Scrooge just said. I don't trust either side. I ain't going to put that against her because, shoot. I mean, I am going to put it against her, but both of these sides is motherfucking crooked. For sure. So if we're gonna question what the fuck she's trying to do, let's question Trump too. This both of the shit, both sides are are corrupted. Period. I just uh, so. But when it comes to those two, I'm not gonna lie. Just be. Uh, I think I'd I rather vote for her ass before him. What let's be your honest. For Brandy. Right, go ahead, bro. I'm I'm a little more subtle, so I'm gonna get I'm gonna say this and get this out the way real quick. Another main reason why I'm not for this dude Trump, right, is because I look at everything that it that he's against. And everything that he's against has helped people who has been fucked up. He don't want to help nobody. And if you ha- and if you're a human being and you give a fuck, you have family members, somebody, somebody along the way, your decision is going to have an effect on yo on you and your peoples. So if you don't give a fuck, then okay, vote for Trump then. But what comes with that, you can't get mad, don't bitch about it, don't get, find yourself getting drunk or, oh, I can't believe this shit, or you, 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 you ain't no job, or you, you find yourself in a fucked up situation, whatever the case may be, whatever fucked up comes behind voting for Trump, you got to accept that. Wait, because man. you play a part in that. Listen, I just want to... It's an overall I big picture, that's all say, I'm saying. I wish I had a better candidate to vote for. I mean, shit, and if you ask me, go vote for RFK, shit. I feel like he might he might be the only one that, that actually might be about what he talk about. Uncle Mike need to get back in the game, man. I ain't going to... I'm, I'm, I might vote. I'm going to go ahead and vote for Kamala if she goes. Because, of course, they're going to put the top uh, two parties against each other. They don't never promote independent party, none of that. I'm going to go for Kamala. I'd rather put my, my vote into her. I already went through what we went through with, uh, with Trump. We would not be in inflation if it right now if it wasn't for Trump knowing about C nineteen, period. 
Yeah, Joe was in there. Every uh, every president that come behind the last president has to clean up their mess. Period. That's what we've been going through. High prices and everything because of Trump. Not only that, he wanted to try to impress uh, Russians and all that type of stuff. Mm. We having disasters across over there in Puerto Rico. He tossing goddamn paper towels in the air like he over there, like he's Stephen Curry and shit. Like, I'm not, no. America was a circus. Then we had all this racial shit going on, the Proud Boys yeah. and all this type of stuff. Like, do y'all really want to go through this? And black people, please stop saying that that man gave us a stimulus check. <laughs> like, for real, I'm sick of it. Like, <laughs> educate yourselves, man. Thank you. Information is everything, man. Everything. He told y'all to drink bleach, for God's sakes. Oh y'all want to go through that? We are. We was a reality TV show. I have I have daughters, I was and this man her. this man doesn't have no regards for a female. He doesn't have a regard for females. Our, our country is a joke, not city. I'm sorry, country is a joke. Let's talk about something else, man. Let's talk Missy about. Elliott. This is not no joke, but it sounds like one. Is the first female <clears throat> rapper, first rapper to ever have her music sent into outer space. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> sent it to a certain planet, though. So they say. I think it was Venus. I need yep. to see these planets. That was her favorite planet. So I they believe. bank. So what? Who the fuck hey, man. Missy Elliott is the first artist That's to the send thing. a hip hop song into outer space. Last week, NASA sent the rain super duper fly from a radio tower in California to Venus, <coughs> which is at Missy Mr. Elliott's favorite planet. Okay, and it took 14 minutes for the song to travel 158 million miles to Venus. But what would be the even? But what, that's the thing. She what? gonna piss off the aliens. That's what I'm saying. Like Me, y'all I'm don't think. Duper flat. But my qu- my question is, what right. is even on Pluto? It's Pluto. Right? Venus. Venus. Okay. So what? Are, what the um, Pluto? That's that's future shit. What is on Venus? We don't know. That what could be receptive <laughs> to this. It. Audio. You song. gotta know that we ain't the smartest people in the universe. No, respectfully so. I know listen, I trust and believe me. Everything that we got right now, they're like I'm 10 to 20 years ahead of we're just we like they had this shit back in 2000. My question is, what qualifies to make a planet your favorite? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a great question. <laughs> is it the color? Is you know, the, the distance, the star count. What the fuck is, is, is she? Is she an alien herself? Or I ain't alien? gonna lie, and is I'm gonna keep it all the way one hundred with y'all. Always the weirdest motherfucker. She sent the wrong song up there. She should have sent "Work It." Where it'd be like, <laughs> 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 They no. probably would have been fucking with hey, that. Hey, like, we, no, hey. you can't be sending no foreign intelligence type of devices over to this foreign planet you're gonna disturb them and you're gonna trigger the aliens Man. like missy we love your music here on earth hey. don't go fucking with venus okay uh, and don't go fucking with your rainus no diddy oh wow <laughs> i'm just don't do that you're gonna trigger the aliens what, scrooge what's your favorite planet oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah, all right. <laughs> Welcome down, but not, nah, but hey, so like, I ain't even Freaky the ass nigga, oh, 69 guy. guy. <laughs> <laughs> Step this way. Step this way. Mine's is Jupiter. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, but listen, though. 14 <laughs> minutes for that song to travel 158 million miles? Niggas ain't shit. <laughs> what, what, what you say? Like, this, is, this is the wrong motherfuckers to be around to share any cause shit like that this. 14 a... minutes to get they to outer it. space. 158 miles away? <laughs> Million, million miles, yeah, miles away. Miles away. 158 million miles away. And it took 14 minutes. I really want to know what's there that could receive How, some shit. How do you even know? Like, what, like, what, like, like what, what the fuck? Yeah, this shit is pissing me off. Did she pay like, for that? And how much was that? Because, nigga, Who the just fuck to send some shit, shit, just to send some shit across country, nigga, is going to be an arm and a motherfucking leg. She, she, Especially she, with your dad on the phone. She could have gave me, I could have put that on Spotify. I don't believe it. I this put this, put this shit I on. I don't hey, believe it. Man, look, Did take, they send the facts it? On that, email? I don't believe it. Email. Who got that? <laughs> See, I'm going to How was it open? Who played it? Who like what? That's what I'm saying. What type of reception? What was what's over there that they that's that, that could receive that? They just, keep playing with our. They keep playing in our face. Yeah, because outer man. space not real. Because you like Jesus, God, you know God. What's the uh, answer? Man, hey, stop, bro. 
What? This is how I'm saying. <laughs> Y'all sending out blank signals to outer space. Tell us something about them aliens you motherfuckers got right here. Man. On Earth. Damn. That y'all didn't confirm. And right, Pat? Fuck going on? 13. What's that? What's that movie? Stay woke. What's, what's that? What's that uh movie that just came what uh about NASA? Booty car? What? Interstellar? What type of shit Woo! you on? Bro? Freaky, Freaky ass, ass nigga. nigga. He's a guy. Yeah, he, on, he on some other hey, shit. Hey. Anyway, uh, that'd be funny. It's a uh it was just a NASA movie that had just came out or whatever, and it actually showed them faking. Going out of space. Oh and shit, all of that Chuck! Look that shit. up. I can't remember the name of the you movie. They made what, what you talking about. They showed the. Yeah, they, 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 they made they, a movie of how if the moon landing really uh, was if, fake. So, so the movie's about they're going to the moon, but they're not sure if they can bring the footage back. So they're going to shoot the footage so that they have footage of it to show. Yeah. Are you uh, sure? Uh, Yeah, they started hiring people to do. Play. Hold on, wait. I'd be nice. So they made this guy. Yeah, they filmed footage just in case the footage that they actually sent out there didn't make it back. Yeah, man, they're lying. Yeah, bro. If you see, <laughs> playing in our faces, if you if you <laughs> see if you if see make it, it back in twenty twenty four, what the oh, fuck was y'all doing in the sixties? Huh, movies bro. called Fly Me to the Moon. Man, look that, and I'm telling you, bro, they got a whole scene, and they hiring people to play roles and characters and shit to act the shit out, and they got motherfuckers really. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> On them, hey, man. Right. and ain't shit going on. They got the <laughs> the, the fans and all type of. <laughs> so have screwed. So have screwed. Man, look, I, that's why I said what I said. Because when he said when he said when he said the shit ain't real, I'm like, boy, they just put it in hey, our face and don't kinda, do that again. I'm trying to tell you, man. Listen, niggas ain't going to outer space, man. That shit that's crazy. why I don't believe this Missy Elliott shit. Because if they can do that in 14 but minutes, why have the fuck have y'all? But Not done another that, moon landing. I was out of, just thinking of, out of all the shit y'all could have said to these motherfuckers out there. You wanted to say, you wanted to hear them. I can't stand the rain. I can't stand the rain. Notice, Brandy. Sound travels. That's what I'm saying. Speed and sound is fast. So so that's a totally different thing. But words is sounds. They can hear me say this. Hey, y'all, give us some technology. Facts. Now, super duper fly. We should have had another moon landing if they can do stuff like this. Yeah. Help us Period. get out of this you bubble. You telling me nothing. I know. You said we should have had an actual moon landing if they could do another stuff like one. this. Another one. Wink, wink. All right. Yeah. Uh, wink, uh, wink. <laughs> the things that make you Who said you it? Go. Who did it? Mm. Mm. Who did that? Uh-huh. 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 All right. All right. Moving right along. This Moving is right beautiful, along. y'all. Oh. Michigan, like sitting Michigan. over there? Nah, it's not. <laughs> oh man, all right. This is Morgan. Oh, she fell in love with Curtis. I was born an uh, intersex woman, and that is when you're oh. born with female and male parts. After sharing their romance online, people questioned Morgan's identity. People think sometimes my husband is gay because I'm intersex. Someone says that's a man we know. Girl, go seek help. Dude in a dress with the gut. That was when I was pregnant. What are you making, honey? Chicken and rice. Oh, yummy. Chicken and rice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working in Leah. <laughs> People always make the wrong assumptions about our relationship. Yeah. Milk and cookie. <laughs> man, uh, goddamn. Uh, Shanene? Man, uh, so, oh my God. So Shanene got. Mm-hmm. Black Jesus. Boy, I ain't gonna be able to Damn, do it. Damn, <laughs> talking. Boy, I ain't gonna be able to do it. Oh, so God. Shanene Damn. Got a Coochie and a Peter Wacker. Ooh, we. Yeah. She, yeah. Hey, I'm. Hey, it, it sounds like so, she got it all under control. She, you, <laughs> you can make babies by yourself and so all listen, that. So <clears> listen, <throat> in the video, well, listen. You see how she's saying that they're trying to say that no, her, that her we're husband not is just going to skate past the fact that this nigga just said you can make babies by, by yourself. Your God. God. Oh, oh, hey. 
<laughs> we is not about to skate past that. We about to. That's okay. definitely keeping the bloodline. Okay. Going. No, first of all, what time out. Wait, y'all? wait. So, what type so of please head you trying to have Look up the, the definition. Look up the definition of intersex, please. It's a so they can understand. It's a hermaphrodite. Oh, no. Yeah. Gotta, or it, has, it, has, it also could be a woman a, uh, with a, a, it's, a. It's literally a hermaphrodite. A yeah, yeah. No, and she's, no. You, you know. have you have it all down there. Yeah, you no, have a penis and a vagina. No, but it also vegetable. could be a person she that has something an about a gorilla coming back, Jesus. but his ass has too much pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, look, all right. <laughs> I, I, I <laughs> Can I get another shot? Because y'all are messed up. So right. listen, I'm going to say, uh, hold on, wait, go ahead, go ahead. because I we start wait. cracking jokes and shit. So I'm, in the video, <laughs> he got the calling and shit, and shit. So in the video, it say that they try to say that her husband is gay because it Arco. has male parts or whatever. Arco. Um, But then it goes to say, that it spent his life being a boy most of its life. Yeah, that's some gay So it's like, so what do you expect for us to think if you decided to start, even if you didn't have both parts? Yeah, facts. Even if you got you, the one part that yeah. swapped out. Yeah. That's like, even more confusion. Like, why would you do that to us? Well, they had thought on, we had you figured out. Somebody was on social Chuck, media like, man, that's Dante. Cuz hell no. Chuck, that nigga play football. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Chuck, that nigga was my running back. Yeah, Look. Nah. <laughs> Black Jesus, that ain't nice. I'm just saying. Nah, on that, so I'm going to say, I like, for me, on a man, on a man, as a man, as a man, <laughs> as an artist, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I, I got, but I gotta stand for as a man. This is I got no jokes inside <laughs> because it's some, it's some no not men around this motherfucker. Not in this motherfucker. I ain't say in this motherfucker. I mean, I mean, nah, nah. This we just got to let the record reflect. <laughs> yeah, the record. I ain't talking about, I ain't talking about these this, ones here, but I'm saying amongst, okay, let me, nah, amongst us. I ain't one. Not uh, us, like in here, though. Amongst us <laughs> all. I ain't one. Viewers included, whatever. Amongst us. Anywho, anywho. Just not on this street. <laughs> <laughs> Since we talking about, <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Talk about this topic, I'm not one. <laughs> Too many jokes is going on, man. Listen, let me bring it back to the original topic, man. Have y'all ever heard of anything like this before? No, sir. That's I have. why I'm confused. I, I mean, not the relationship, but I heard of... An intersex? The, uh, I thought that parts? shit was fake. Yeah, the I heard. Part? Yeah, the double part. I've, I've heard I that have. before. It, it uh, fucked me up when it said it was pregnant. That's why I was like, damn, so... Motherfuckers can have babies, like, and then you fucked me up when you said what you said. Yeah. I won't repeat that. I thought that shit was like, man. Hearing about but, unicorns. Oh, man. But I, I just thought I that shit didn't exist. I for a uni- seeing a unicorn to be some type of a graceful experience. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all remember? Mm. I thought that, I'm saying, <laughs> hearing about it, I never thought that, I never thought that shit was, I thought that shit was a myth. <laughs> okay. I never thought that shit was hey, real. Speaking of myths, right? Y'all yeah. remember the uh, birds ain't real shit? Nah. They were saying yeah. that they are cameras spying yeah. on us. Oh. I never believed that shit. That shit real. I hate the oh, here I hate go, this. Be birds oh, ain't real, shit. huh? Listen, y'all gotta Beasy start checking start patents. That shit. Listen, this so there I was thing. judging motherfuckers for thinking that there are cameras in the birds, but here I am going through the CIA's declassified documents, and bitch, there are, there are fucking cameras in the birds. Oh my so God. here I am scrolling through, and I see what what oh. is that? Bird camera program? All right. What is the literal first sentence? Technical collection team has been formed to demonstrate the operational utility of the avian asset. As a part of this effort, a new bird camera has been designed, which weighs less than the old one and which uses a 16 millimeter film with motion compensation instead of the nine millimeter size. Dang. So so we, we were doing this like way back in the day in 1976 when we were still using film. Dang. And so I continue you scrolling down and they they continued this this was something they updated multiple times and mm-hmm. continued to fund just in 1976 or from when i can find these documents they funded almost a million dollars into this program Dying. and you're going to sit here and you're going to tell me that they couldn't do similar stuff today look at that camera 
That's obvious as shit, but this was in the 70s. Mm. And I'll leave you with something else that might give you some spooks. This article in Redacted is factually reliable and presents a reasonable picture of some aspects of the field of electrical brain stimulation from the layman's point of view. After our experiments at the Redacted had demonstrated the practical feasibility of electrical brain stimulation as a guidance technique. And that would be all well and good until you scroll down to the bottom of this last page. We feel we are close to having debugged a prototype system whereby dogs can be guided along specific courses through land areas, out of sight and at some distance from the operator. The purpose being to completely redacted. And then we get down to this bottom sentence. Dr. Redacted is taking appropriate action to exploit our knowledge in this area and provide adequate background for the development of future agency applications in the general areas of influencing human behavior, indirect assessment, and interrogation aids. So, uh, I... Lenny, I'm gonna have to brush... All right. So, hmm. Things that make you go, hmm. Mm -hmm. I always feel like... Oh, my God. Somebody's watching, watching me. And, uh, to they those who don't us. know, redacted Bullshit. means that's the part of the, <laughs> the classified, the declassified file that they still will not tell you. They ain't watching so with them there birds. was a, an actual doctor that was doing studies and somebody and they had a plan to do something that they still haven't told us. But I just wanted to say, like, when they was talking about the dogs, they could have been did this years ago, because, like, think about the invisible fence. If they would just put that around a bunch of shit oh, and yeah, tell the dog the to dog. go, it would only be able to go certain ways mm -hmm. because it would get shot. Right. Boom. Now you could easily tie explosives to a dog, send it in somewhere you want to go. Just, you know, and. Why does our country feel like this is necessary? Because something's coming. Because we, we're nosy as they, fuck. We, we want to be in our you. business, they business, what? they business, and, and don't forget about they business. This is how spies. we send coups to other countries to take over yeah. what we want. But they we not, they're not using them. They, they, like, they literally what? just put this shit everywhere. They, they not, put it in your face, bro. Like, you just... It just go over your head. Ooh. Cartoons and movies, all this kind of shit, you just bro. Ain't gonna believe they're it. not using them birds on us. They're using them. If those are actually on, real, they they're using those as spies for other countries. Like like how wait they got the Chinese. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on. Can I, can I, can I, can I shoot them? Can I spy ahead. them? Ahead, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm cook, out here duck hunting. Go ahead, cook. Go ahead, cook. All right. They use that type of stuff as spies type of stuff to go over there to the other country, just like how we thought that the Chinese people were sending the uh, balloons and shit over here as a, you feel me? That's different type of things that they use for, they're not using it over here. They, you know what they Did use over here? You know what they the use over Panthers? here? What? Straight ass drones. I be seeing them all in Westwood. Well, yeah, they look for somebody around this but mug. They don't need to spend that type of money on civilians. On that is for what do you consider countries over there? That, that is was, our. They said but, they was in the seventies though. They started this shit now. I mean, this ain't nothing new. They might test it on us, but of course yeah, that type of that's technology. What I'm Remember what they was doing with the Black Panthers and how they investigated them? That was the FBI, CIA. Yeah. Well, they well, wasn't well, using them birds. This is what the I'm bird, saying. Bird, bird, bird. <laughs> the bird is the word. I'm, a, I'm sorry. Once we get smart enough. To learn to avoid the drone, the drones and shit, you gotta know that it's gonna be a bird outside somebody's trap house watching a nigga drop off or pick up a brick. Mm, 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 mm. I'm telling you. Eventually, that. once niggas get smart enough to say, "Okay, we can't do transit. We gotta find a way to avoid these," a nigga ain't never gonna suspect a fucking a bird. bird sitting there just. We gonna Especially if that motherfucker can shit like them little baby dogs that they be making. <laughs> we gonna Nigga use that gonna type of stuff understand. more on other countries to the bird get the, watch you yeah, and shit on you and information to shit. to get to get the information to spy and everything before we use that on on some regular civilians to Hold get brainwashed but, but off of television. They started off using the drones over there though, we and then they brought that shit over here. Television and entertainment. It'd be a waste of American dollars to spend that on our dumbasses when all they got to do is give us C four. Drinks and we. <laughs> but this is the thing, though. They do <laughs> spend. They do. They, they spend. I was about to say. They, they did the same shit with the drones <laughs> before they was using them over here. That was they was flying personal, around wasn't? Afghanistan with goddamn like, little yeah. mini machine guns on the motherfucker. Exactly. But this. But they been uh, spending money to spy on us. Right. Wiretaps, all type of shit, regardless of whatever method or tactic that they use, they've been investing and in putting money into shit to spy on us yeah, civilians. Yeah. Let me cook. And How over many? the years, like, like, think about it. Okay, so they had some advanced shit just they was in the 70s. 
that's that's some advanced shit that we would have thought back in the seventies. Like what do who you feel what I'm saying? Yeah, in the seventies. So if they were like again, this goes back to the statement I just made a couple minutes ago. We're getting some shit that they we're they're. 20, 20 years, yes. 30, 40 we're behind. years. The shit like they a motherfucker. Got, they already, listen, only a video it's, game. 2020, it's 2024 right Beasy. now. They Call already of Duty. got some shit set up for 2020. Call of Duty. No, for 2060, we the, 2070. Listen, we're behind on what. We the, the iPhone 15 and they the iPhone the 30, God damn it. Go. They already got the shit <laughs> already. And so again, so if they are ahead like that, you best believe they have the resources and the funds yeah. to spy on us. And that shit they is. They been do, but they're not using brandy. them birds on us. They're, they're using the old shit, shit on us. The drones. The, the dr- they drones. still using they, the old man, listen, shit on us. They using bird, drones. Bird, bird, they bird, using bird, birds. Bird. They using niggas. They, they using, using all lights. type of shit, man. They using cameras they every use, fucking where. Man, they got them on wheels. Yo, phone. <laughs> you right you outside, your, right here. Right right outside your phone they telling you on the streets that they got a camera on this speed light. One microphone. If you turn your phone off, they have the ability to activate a microphone to hear your conversation. I was just about to say, like, how many times have you just been talking and then be like, hey, bro, we need to get this for the uh, for the shit. And then you'll be scrolling and boom. So, mm-hmm. so BZ, can we agree to what I was saying? What is the point? Y'all just explained all of that. How they got all that on our phones. So what is the point of disguising a fucking bird for us? No, that is for them other fucking countries. To spy. No, they don't need to no, disguise a no, bird wait, wait, or a teddy bear go, or anything. We already listen, know we're being white. Listen, Brandy, listen. Now, really hear me out on this. I just gave example. They used it on us to make sure it worked. Then they sent yeah, it overseas. Yeah, you got to use us as the lab rats. Of course. But now so they don't we, They don't need them birds to spy on they us. They still use them if it works. Mm. <laughs> they they don't need them birds to spy. <laughs> they ain't need no birds to spy on CMO3 get killed on that highway. We already know it's cameras out there. It's the Patriot Act so back in 9 11. Look it that. up. What are you saying, Chuck? I think an elaborate ass, real looking bird camera is practical use in private, in like public civilian society. They don't have enough of them to do it properly. The drones they use on They got a machine they, making <laughs> bird after bird after <laughs> bird after bird <laughs> right they now. They don't have enough birds. They, 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 they pressing them they up. They ain't got enough head of money. They, they got the equipment. If they, they can make that many they, tanks, why can't they make mechanized birds? Man, if they done. can sit They're here and got easy. machines to sit here and make all this they goddamn print the paper, 3D they meat, can make this shit. you <laughs> goddamn better believe <laughs> they got <laughs> them. Come on, man. They you print print the know how many fucking people in the fucking world? You got me fucked up. You thinking they making this goddamn fake ass me, they ain't can't put no feathers on some shit for the camera. No cat. I just thought about it. Jeezy no, really got us over here arguing bro. about birds. We not oh, about shit, birds. You bro. just in hey. disbelief. That nigga said if they got the technology to make this 3D meat. <laughs> oh, shit. In your face. Oh, yeah. yeah. For real, man. You are crazy. And they always say to, 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 like, to get away with some shit is to be right in their face underneath their nose. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's hiding out in I plain sight. Plain Come on, yeah. bro. Right make it make right. sense. I so if so. it worked, they still doing that shit. We just ain't never thought about it. I, I never thought about it until the subject came up. I think we've up. come to a conclusion 36. on this one. Mm-hmm. All right, all right. So, Thanks. Yago, I would like for you to walk this one down oh, for shit. me, man, because it's, it's kind of a long one if I try to let it play. It's the Young Thug new... It really ain't long. It's really like an update from what we was talking about last week. About well, you want to do it because the video long that you, that's in here. Man, long story short. Yeah, thank you. The judge got removed. We already talked about that, right? Right. right. And they... Okay, but the... It's, tell us about the new judge, do you know? Yeah, the new judge is basically like Bruss said, the bitch strict. Yeah, like she the she won't let the book. she won't let Young Thug wear headphones. He can't dress a certain way. Like it's all kinds of shit. There will be absolutely no disruptions in the courtroom. Why yeah. would he wear headphones in a trial? In the first place, yeah. they was letting him be because it was the fucking shit show. Yeah. Because it was a fucking shit show. That shouldn't have been allowed to begin that let with. You, yeah. that, again. The music but during the trial. Listen, I brought this up to he say to you, head. like, it's Real even high. shit on there where she like, the prosecution better have their witnesses back to back. We not waiting. We not doing it. We doing this by the book. Oh. So considering how much of a shit show it's been, I think that type shit might work in favor for Thug, just the way how her being by the book and the the um, the prosecution on some lame shit they really ain't by the book and i think that's gonna hurt them in the long run because they clowns for real again 
everything I said last week is so they got a stricter one. Mm-hmm. She going to run this a little differently. Yeah. Again, rather he go down for what they trying to stick him for. <laughs> going down they going to find something <clears throat> to stick him with. And the whole thing about trials, <laughs> if anybody is not informed about them, when you have jury selection and once your jury is picked or whatever, the judge has rules that the, he has to give them. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And so if the charges that you are being charged with, if they don't find you guilty of that, but they can find you guilty of a lesser charge. Right. And you can still do the special. You know what I'm saying? They can so if, bro, so if so if one is being charged with murder, you know what I'm saying? Okay, the ju- the jury don't see murder, but they see manslaughter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you ain't going to prison for life. You but you still that. going to you prison, and you yeah, you're going to and you going to do however much time they decide. That mandatory you, nine. You, you feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So that's how that's how the jury selection and and and, and trial and, and rules and shit is given. So again, if he don't go down for what they're hitting him with, I still think that it's enough bullshit there for them to still stick right, something. Let's to let's him. hear from B Diddy. What's up? I just want to stop saying that. No Diddy. Yeah. <laughs> but earlier you was just saying take that. Uh-oh. Take that, take that, because it was nice when it came when he said it. The first time was cool. It, it was a good Cut follow that shit up. Out. <laughs> it was a good follow up, but no, I just said though. <laughs> all of y'all forget all this little street stuff and yeah. all the stick to the code. Uh huh. So do any of y'all feel like he um, he's innocent? Y'all feel like he's innocent? Hell nah. <laughs> No. Okay, you say no. One, one, two, three, four. Feel. <laughs> oh, no, Heart go. Heart go. No, nah, black Jesus. No, nah, black, nah, black Jesus. No, black Jesus. Come on, screws. Beasy said no. I'm, I'm, I'm with. I'm, 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 I'm self incrimination, nigga. You mean I'm trying? You I'm, don't even matter. He's stuttering, you Stanley. You not Ain't part of the Rico. Rico. I said I was with Arco. I plead. Man, Arco gonna get his chance to answer. No, Arco gonna answer. Turn anyway. <laughs> Nino, hmm? I'm saying his. Talk answer. to me, man. What was the question? Oh, Do he man. not like he Thug not, is You guilty. think <laughs> Thug really guilty? Whether whether he's you guilty think he or not. You think he innocent or guilty? Keep it real. You think, you think he did that shit? You think he did this shit? Forget the streets, though. Come on. What, what's wrong with your shoulders? They're my shoulders. <laughs> hey. <laughs> he my shoulders. What Dave Chappelle say? That nigga did that. <laughs> <laughs> Busy, they ain't gonna answer the question. Hold on, wait. Go Do ahead, I think host. Young Thug did what? No, we didn't say did. No, do you believe that he's either <clears throat> guilty or innocent? Forget that street guilty stuff. Guilty for what? Because he's uh, mu- he multiple charges. I mean, he got a Yeah, like, Rico but case, murder, there's some stuff. Gang shit. Do you think he is guilty of that shit? That this whole case. We ain't even going to get into detail. This whole case. Do you think he innocent? <laughs> nah, that's a lot of young thugs out you there. Know? <laughs> <laughs> you know he was doing things. I looked at you and said, you don't see what he's trying to do? He's trying to deflect the question. He acting like he's on the stand right now like the Woody dude. He said like the Woody dude. Y'all niggas acting like y'all. Go matter. ahead, ho. Everybody has an opinion. Y'all gonna like, oh, y'all shit matter. Go uh, ahead, ho. In, in the actual trial, like like one of the jurors gonna be like, they, right. they, they, they scared me. Hey, no, that. but no, I'm just playing. Hey, no, hey, I, on a serious, I, yeah, nigga, I think he did. I think he went all that shit. All that shit. Mm. Yeah, Draco under the skirt on that. Hey, I think he on that. I had to wear that. <laughs> <laughs> That's Why what did he, he said. say that? That's what he said. He said For he real, had to wear the skirt because he, he had the stick. Draco, and that him. didn't make no sense to me. Cause nigga, back in the day, motherfuckers was putting on trench coats, nigga, just to cover up a shot, a salt off. So why the Tell fuck would you feel brother. like you had to put on a skirt? <laughs> to, cover <laughs> cover up, to cover up mm. a hey. fucking chopper, nigga. Hey, you ain't that no makes no sense. So? It was Motherfuck- marketing. It was marketing. Yeah, why that, I, 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 it, that's it, why. It, the answer to your question is marketing. I mean, um, they had you, to, saw it, you saw it. You saw it. You saw it. You saw it. She saw it. Chuck, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Chuck, did you? So he, nah. He but, 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 hold, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me land. Let hey, me did land. you see that clip I put in the land. group? No, hold on. Let me land. On mm. top of all of that, the dress and all that one shit to stick up under the dress, the album was yeah. fire. It was. 
I'm not a thug. I'm not a thug. I'm not a thug. I'm not a thug. I didn't care. Yeah, I mean, I don't care about that shit. You know, I'm not one of those. Like that's that's facts. That shit was fire. That's one's opinion. That's one's opinion. Man, look, I'm not a thugs fan, and I never listened to it. Baby Kiss Wayne niggas still rocking, banging that Carter. Can I let you hear something real quick? Yo, I was a kid. Yeah, he was a kid. Let me land. Let me land. All right, we can continue our fire. conversation. I just wanted to. Niggas be fucking stealing. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. What? That shit's scary, ain't it? Oh. Niggas stealing. That's crazy. That shit's scary that that boy Joe be stealing. You niggas like stealing. <laughs> You know what damn. else is scary? You just this come is, fuck is, with us, uh, send us some little money on us. Nigga, if that's the case, damn, what, you ain't got to steal. That's crazy. Put some money behind us. God damn. Hey, oh, yeah, go. Yeah, they not believe it still. Whoa. Man, for real, though. <laughs> Woo, that's a week fresh. <laughs> Woo. That's crazy. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, you man. You got look. started, Nino. The hell with you. Hey, but look, though. This that's is fire, a, though. This is supposed to be a uh, no Charleston more. White last fire. Saturday. <laughs> Not no more. That's fire. We up to something. Let's go, y'all. The things that he said on this interview are dangerous. The government is not going to like this. But what's next for America after Joe Biden and Donald Trump? Uh, war, war in America. Mm -hmm. I believe uh, that. It, it's inevitable that at some point in our lifetime, that bombs will be dropped in America, just like every other country have had bombs, have had war in their country. Just like what we're seeing in Ukraine and Russia, it will be here. But the only difference is, the people to do us like that is already here in planet. They were here, they've been here since the 80s. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Every country has, America has been invaded a long time ago. The world know you can't beat America from attacking them from the outside, coming mm -hmm. attacking. You can't beat them. So they've been sending people over here to learn us. Mm -hmm. America has 99 different tongues in it. They brought their cultures. Mm -hmm. They brought their people. They got stem. They got sleeper cells here. They got sleeper cells here. That's been waiting, and they've been waiting, and they've been living amongst us. They have assimilated. They know our culture. They know our highways. That's what's coming. Because we have weakened, we have weakened, we, we're no longer a superpower. We are a weakened superpower because we have been at war for over 200 years. United States of America have. We are weak. So only thing we got left to do is to, is to push a nuke and destroy the world and start a nuclear world war. That's our only major defense. But we was we was attacked with the coronavirus that's what people fail to realize the coronavirus was world war three the next is world war four that weakened our military that weakened our government that that brought district men the first thing that happened when we realized what the pandemic was was we shut our country down and we started passing war defense acts <laughs> that part. if you do your research so that's what's to come, homie. America is crumbling, is tumbling, and we're going against one another. On top of that, that's Dumbass. where we're losing it because America is no longer united. Democrat hate Republican, Republican hate Democrat, gay hate straight, straight hate gay. It's too <clears throat> much hate in America for America to win any more wars. Mm, mm, that nigga ain't never wrong. I'm mm. telling you, that's my new nigga, bro. I don't think that nigga, far yet. man, that's my nigga, bro. That. That's my nigga, bro. He, that. that's he, my said, nigga. he said that's what's to come. I don't think it's that far yet. Okay, well, Mike, I want to hear from Diarco. You don't think what's that far yet? I don't think it's that far yet as far as the hatred goes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, anytime, <laughs> all right, we, we might go through our shit, but anytime it's a natural disaster or anything like that, you know what I'm saying? We know how to come together and protect our shit. A bro. lot of you know people do that shit for perception, <clears throat> bro. A lot of that shit just whether, for the with, sake of Whether the, the reason, it, it don't matter. They do it. You know what I'm saying? Like shit, and they gonna try their best. I mean, but it like do it. matter if everything that come I, behind it is some know. bullshit. It don't, man, don't talk me, no. it don't matter why a motherfucker saving you at the end of the day, you gonna thank them. Like, it don't matter what they did it for. If you fucked up and the motherfucker helped you out, 
It don't matter what the reason they did it, folk. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be, like, good looking out. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it's going to happen. You feel me? Like like I said, we paying together and we know how to look out for each other when they come down to it. You know what I mean? Like, regardless of the bullshit, that's just how I feel about it. Go ahead. I I, cause I got. I, I want to cook off that. Go ahead. Go ahead. Anybody? You, you remember the Somebody. KKK just came to day a couple years ago? Mm-hmm. What, what happened, Bezo? Not nah, shit happened, but I'm just saying, like, if we really was together and united, KKK would have been demolished a long time ago. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because that's hate and mm-hmm. self embodiment right there. Mm-hmm. That's mm-hmm. what we talking about America all together. That's we're not America. Talking about we're in America. Black yeah, versus that's white. Bro, we, we talking to he talking about the I guess I feel what you're saying. No, 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 no. But no. we talking, I'm, hey. I'm speaking like as far as like. Us oh, versus God, them type God. shit. Like, if it come down to, like, motherfuckers actually bombing our country type shit. Like, I understand. Like I said, like he said, it's Republican versus Democrat. And it's all of that. Like I said, yeah, we go through all our bullshit. But when it come down to it, yeah. I think we going to stick together and fight for our it's shit. Arco, never been. It's Arco, yes, it has. Yes, it has. Arco is guess right about that. Has. Arco is right about that. Guess what has. When 9-11 hit, I ain't never seen. And I was still, I was a kid at that time. America came together like a motherfucker. Yeah. They was hating on Arabs like a boy, listen, so, Muslims, so, anybody that had a turban around their head. That's when it so comes to like us, it was the yeah. Yeah. that shit came no, from y'all, the end. Y'all not listening to what he's saying. He's saying, what Arco is saying is, yes, we have our own issues and we go through our own bullshit, but when it comes to hatred against other countries, whatever, America does stick together. Listen, I do people. Yeah. Is because, that what you were saying, Arco? Yes, that's that's exactly. But this is my whole thing. Yeah. Of course, if it takes for us to help them stay alive, why wouldn't they want us to come together? But anytime it's not Independence Day, y'all talking about in a catastrophic, uh, all hands on situation. But we yeah. talking about a day to day life where these motherfuckers, the KKK, <laughs> had police security. Fact. While they was in our city. Yeah. That woman That's just true. got shot. In, okay, so perfect example. Lady that just got shot in her head after she done did Sonya all Macy. this. If if the shit with whatever her name is, if the shit was going down and it was an invasion, you don't think they would have, if, if it was about to be shoot her in the head and then they find <laughs> out that we being invaded, they'd probably hand her a pistol in that very instance just because it's us or them. Of course. If they need us, of course they're going to come to help us or they're going to come to aid or come of together because we don't have no but other choice. Don't think twice. Don't don't make no mistake that the, the other side ain't going to give a fuck about the differences that we going through. You understand? Exactly, like, bro. Nick, you, that's no so tossed and They're going to come after <laughs> everybody that's over here, bro. Okay, Diaco, let me ask you something. Do like you know you, what a sleeper what cell gonna, is? <laughs> you're, not, you're not just going to be able to say, hey, bro, I'm with you. You feel me? Nah, they're going to be like, Nick, fuck you too. You feel me? But sh- like shit that, shouldn't just have to hit the fan for it to no be like that. You ain't going to have no choice but though. to defend your turf. Is you all I'm saying. Okay, but that's true. But but walk with me now. Yeah? Do you know what a sleeper cell is? No, I'm not aware Okay, a sleeper cell is all the immigrants and everything in there that pretending like they're just here to live the American life. No, when shit here. hit the fan, when shit hit How the fan, A-Rab they you are see a day. faction together. Well, and I'm guess who they want to? And guess who they want to kill? I'm they want to kill more us. them than us at this point. How many? As far as my daily okay, living. So goes. let me ask you this: How many ignorant white people do you think is really gonna take you up in arms if it come down to them versus us? Mm. They don't give a fuck if you live or die. They're gonna mm. sacrifice you first. Exactly. Mm. You are gonna be a meat shield. Exactly. Mm. Now, if I knew that and I'm the other country, hmm. let's say all you have to do is play your cards right, and you just you can make a race war easy. Now, easy. guess what? While now, your government is in martial law trying to contain the country, we, we really bomb. Now, now, when you say it like that, when you say it like that, you get no martial law. When you say it like that, now the way the way it's set up now, you know what I'm saying? At this, <laughs> Brandy, what you mean? Brandy, when you're getting into martial Brandy law? don't think Look, the birds coming. Law. She hey. don't think we can go into martial law. You <laughs> she you don't. I if we have a race war, we're never right going to martial law. I'm just saying, y'all know y'all motherfucking history. Real quick, let me let me get it out the way. Where, but all I'm saying is, you write about that, and it's possible that I could fuck around and. And, and slip through the cracks. I ain't gonna hold you, but you never yeah. know. Yeah, you right about that. Yeah. We ain't. We don't never have martial law. Cause I fucks with a lot of them. You know what I mean? Like it, they really history. fuck with me too. Like, but on some real shit. Like, what what part of history did I miss? B, tell me. Let me tell you, we, 
you living in it right here. History, shoot, history don't mean just a long time ago. History can almost, uh, can also mean yesterday. You know how many mm. doggone times, like especially uh, what was that massacre in in uh, Texas some years years ago? When a, El Paso uh, man and them people stood up like you got me Waco. Oh, you got go, me yeah. fucked up. You gonna uh, take my off. goddamn rights over my goddamn firearm? Chainsaw. People yeah. ain't going for that. Ain't no martial law. You gonna take my goddamn gun? You gonna do? What is wrong with you? Not text. It's the it's the rag. It's the rag. It's the rag. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say this. But no, when he when when he speaks, January uh, six should have gave when he when he when he speaks of uh, the hate factor. That is something that has been planted forever. And so it goes that way, sir. So with that being with the hate the seed the hate seed being planted, right? <coughs> with it evolving, he's absolutely right, bro. Cause why do black people hate other black people? You know what I'm saying? So you do got stray, you got people who are actually homophobic. You got people who I don't think these people should exist. They shouldn't do this, that, and the third. He is uh, he's speaking a, a, a raw truth that a lot of people don't want to fucking acknowledge, bro. Facts. He, is, he, 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 he is he he spit he is mm-hmm. raw. His delivery is off the chain. And I think that's why a lot of people can't take him, bro. That's why I say he my yeah. new nigga. Because everything how I, like the morals and the like I feel everything that man be saying. Like real talk. But it, Hearing that information, what are you going to do about it? Hey, listen, this is this is Charleston White in a nutshell. Great message, piss poor delivery. But what? he has told y'all he has to deliver it like that for people to, it's shock value. Yeah. When he was doing shit the right way with his polo tucked in, trying to be with the police, nobody, nobody gave a fuck it. about Charleston White. But as soon as he got out there and started denouncing rappers and talking about fuck they dead homies and shit, he, went, he, he blew up and he had a good message behind it. Listen. He go too far sometimes. Absolutely, but what's too far? Cause everybody go too far. No, it's a, what's it's too a far? Long, hey, long, so let me ask long, you this: Why is Charleston long, White saying "fuck these video. dead people" too far? But when rappers do it, it's okay. That's what I'm saying. What's no, too no, no. far? I, I I agree with a lot of stuff that he say, but sometimes he does push the envelope. Well, you got to tell me. What, I'm asking what is, again. Is, what's I just too said far? it's too much evidence and too much. That's too long for conversation. It's a list. What? It's a lot of stuff that he well, does. Right. I, I want you to give me your top number one. Like when he crossed that line, you was like, "Nah, fuck Charleston White." Yeah, the one, I'm, just uh, the one time that you could just think. No, of. that's too long for conversation. Yeah, well, hey, no, 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 I not. agree okay. with some of the things that he says because I was raised old school as well. But yes, so he does what's the say a one lot thing of stuff you for disagree shock with? Um, I've seen him talk shit about. I mean, even with him talking about uh, uh, dead people and everything. But at the same time, you contradict yourself because you want better for the youth, all that type of stuff. You're too fucking old, and you got this cock eye, glass eye in your eye. Sir, you just, like, damn, like, don't stop doing what that. What the hell having a glass eye got to do with nothing? Like, stop only, that, you the old only dead people and everything. The on is the ones you that be You out at fucking people. comedy shows at the end and having to bring out your switchblade. and all. You're too old to be going through all of that. For you to just try to get clout, and sometimes a lot of times he does have a good message. Me go, but like doing all that extra stuff, you can't try to get on your community for acting stupid and being thugs out here. But Somebody you also out to. here sometimes talking like a thug too. No, you just said we need multiple leaders. No, you cannot again. You cannot be out here like trying to. You cannot be out here trying to educate your community and then turn around and talking just like the motherfuckers that you be. Talking about you don't uh you it's don't how like he out got here. our attention. Did you hear me? Then that's sad. Nobody heard that's him a when sad he was doing thing. it the right if way. It took, if it took for your mental to get to get you acquainted with him. You didn't know who Charleston White Damn. was till he started doing shock value. Dang. Mm-hmm. No, not really. See? Yeah, I know. Nobody not really. knew who Charleston White was. Not really. But at the he same time, I did watch a couple of things to see what he was saying. But as time went by, Charleston was start, he by was doing too much. By the time you heard of Charleston White, he had to talk like that that's to and, get big. And that's sad. He Where the fuck is the moral? But life being on the right side of the that's, law with his polo tucked in. So look, you blame telling him. this is all I'm saying. This is all I'm saying. I don't know if it's the if it's the Kiara Casamigos. Yeah, this is all that, I'm saying. That's what it is. I don't respect that. 
if that's what it costs for you to get the bag and get this shock value, I don't stand on that. So, I stand on morals. Be true to yourself. I don't like that cloud chasing because I could have did blame? that can shit. I, so can I, I'm can sorry. I, so can I get, and if that's what it takes for y'all to get for, to get y'all attention, I'm sorry. We cut from a different cloth. We I'm cut a, I'm different play, network. I'm going to play devil's advocate, right? Because I'm going to say this. Can't convince Hold me, on. Scrooge. No, listen to me. I live by Let, a different brain. That's fine. Listen My grandparents to, uh, okay, raised me. Okay, that's fine. Listen to me. Be open-minded. Listen to me. I ain't telling you to change your opinion. I'm telling you to hear an opinion. Okay? If you're saying if he had to do that, it's sad, then that's because society has made it that way. Mm-hmm. If he was... Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Before you interrupt me, because it's on the tip of them lips. Listen. <laughs> no diddy. No diddy. <laughs> She's a whole woman. How the fuck is that no diddy? <laughs> anyway, oh, no, come on. Say, no, land, brother, <laughs> land, brother, <laughs> land. So, <laughs> any, so, so anywho, if... if that, yeah. So, if that's the way he has to get one's attention for the message to get God, it don't matter how he came. Did you get the message? If everybody, everybody's not gonna listen to this soft, sweet, kind, hey, hey, man, you can do this. You go to school, whatever. The <laughs> society is pushing this ratchet ass shit. So saying, stop fuck your dead homies. Minute, I'll uh, piss on that grave. Right. That's, that's a message. Right. That's a message. That's a message. Let me. Hey, I got my apron on. If I, if society is putting this Ooh, y'all crazy. to where I have to gain one's attention. Mm. To get the message, then that's what that's the approach that I have to take. Hey, regardless hey. if that's how I Ooh. perceive to do it personally, but I have to do whatever I have to do to get your attention. And sometimes saying some ratchet ass shit. Fuck your dead homies, wait real a, people that die. Wait a minute. Because well, this the whole thing. Do you feel that way about the motherfucker that's talking about the dead nigga that's recording? He that don't even know these shit? niggas. So, okay, you talking about niggas that you don't even don't, know. Don't, King Von and I, all them. But, but they and talk you about me to take advice niggas. from people, you. Hold, but you want me to take advice from on, you for when you're talking positive? No, nigga, on. you sold your soul to the devil for you to be able to have shots. But he speak on he speak on them as demons. If that was a preacher doing that, y'all. I will talk about that preacher. Can I finish cooking? Am I laughing though? Can I finish cooking? Have it you ever no seen a preacher It ain't no difference from a person reciting the same fucking lyrics. And don't nobody know these niggas personally neither. These the same niggas that you talk about. Oh, that nigga cute. He fine. All this old dumb, crazy ass cute shit that females be doing. But yet it's still you want to sit here and try and preach another narrative? No, mama. No. That's some cricket ass. That's some. That's some. You talking about them other females, no, no, you didn't sit here and said that. You ain't talking about me. I'm talking, talking about, about the other B. Diddy. Females. I'm talking about you. Brandy Danielle. Did you just got me B. Diddy again? I'm talking about you. Hey, no, I'm about to say no you I'm talking about way. other no, females. Baby, I'm talking about you. Because that's not, not me. That, that, but that's being you. I've sat here across from you and you to sat here and spoke on these niggas. Spoke but again, Dirk, Vaughn, Vaughn, what is you talking Dirk. about? And niggas be reciting these lyrics and they, and they say fuck each other all the time. Okay, but you, don't but know you me. ain't seen me you out here know. motherfucking being on a broadcast, be going viral right? and saying here, fuck these niggas. Yeah, no, you, yeah. I have never did it here either. So don't put that on me, homie. But don't I'm put say, that on my body. Don't so, put that on my on, body because I ain't never did that. I ain't never sat on this dog on podcast. No, 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 we cooking. I ain't never sat on this podcast and said, yeah, fuck such, such. No, baby, I ain't never did that. That's what Charleston White did. I didn't say did. So uh uh-uh, uh, take that back. I didn't say you did that. Diddy, now you keep calling you me B. Miss, Diddy. Miss Reed, take that, yeah. take that, you take that right, back. All right, all right. Let's reel it back. You let's let's, all right. let's dial I'm, it back. It's the got out of control. Listen, I'm, we, I'm we cool. done lost. Nah, because we, he didn't say that you said no. that. He did that's just right. say that. He, me. Did he not me. just say I've been on this pod saying do Lil Dirk Vaughn? No, y'all said we've talked about Lil Dirk. Yeah, you misread me. You just went somewhere else with that. I ain't say yeah. You. We just gonna take the boat in a whole nother direction. Let's keep. Let me try the boat. Y'all ain't gonna say on my side. Hold up, what you doing with that? On my bad. Listen, you right. Before we. This is his method because the same people that he's talking about, these are the same motherfuckers that label themselves as demons. And all they talk about is killing niggas. So you can't be mad at him if he speak about them, how they refer to themselves as demons. Are you going to have any remorse for a demon or how you speak of one? 
Like you were just talking about. I just, hold on, wait. I'm, I'm, I just I, want you. Hold on, wait. Like I want to ask you a yes or no. About how the um how the officer got triggered. Hold on, wait. And then These you talking need about a map because they on, lost. Listen, Brandy, listen to me, sis. No, listen to me. It for ain't real. rocket science. What I've been look, twin, f- feel what I'm saying to you though. And when you talk about his approach no. and how he decided to approach people, now with you being a mother, being from the environment that you from and your upbringing that you from, if you would have been like. Hey Jordan, can you please pick up your can you please pick up your toys? Can you please That's clean not the that? Same thing. He's go but listen, he's gonna go on about his business, keep making That's a mess. The and uh, but you say, thing. hey, Jordan, what I tell your ass? That's not go the get same them goddamn thing. toys up. But it's the same. Yes. This nigga has talked about dead people. Brandy. That and talked everything. about Brandy. that talked it's about simple, killing son, people it's and dead people. Wrong. It's a simple no, call no, and what the, what you, you're, you're still simple thinking about what response. he's saying about people. This what I'm saying lost. is about mm-hmm. how he gained your attention. If it took that, he's not going to be. So, he's not going to be soft spoken. I'm not talking about him talking about dead people. So let me see I'm y'all just do that shit. About it's a simple call you, and response. If it was set, that easy, That's y'all it. be doing it too. So let me do. Let me see y'all do that it, shit. It is the same it's thing. Brandy, listen, I'm not it's talking. Not in y'all this is what you're not understanding. You Brandy, listen to Would me. Listen to me. Look at me. Hey, look over here, big dog. Over this subject. No, because y'all can't change my mind. He does it every time we get together in pod. I he was I'm not talking about dead people. I'm talking about Stop his clapping approach. Your thighs, bro. No, because you're not understanding it's what not I'm that saying. No, it's it's about not subject. Brandy, listen to it's what about I'm saying. How quick Next he gonna subject. do? No, you're not understanding. It's because of his Don't approach. Ass, it's bro. not about dead people. It's about what he's saying and how he's saying it. Because if Scrooge wasn't as passionate, we wouldn't pay him as much attention as when he's doing this. And he's being loud and he's doing this. Mm-hmm. Antics. And he's not fucking flexing thing, his arms at us like please. this. <laughs> it's I not the same thing. Arm. Next I'll subject, please. Put them down, please. Put them down bro. I'm it's sorry. But I'm saying, thing. it's not about the whole... See, you trying to stick oh to the gosh. point about him... Next it's subject, all right. please. It's all right. All right. Bring your show. Bring your show, Bring your show. Please. It's not that serious. Reportedly suffocated eight-year-old cousin you need to look at the thing for you. Best, Run that po- back. We ain't here best podcast in America. Let's go. You know it. 12-year-old girl reportedly suffocated 8-year-old cousin in dispute over iPhone, police say. This is in Tennessee, a 12-year-old girl. Hold on, wait. Say it again? I'm about That's to run right. the news clip. Fuck you up, baby. A disturbing baby. situation happening in Humboldt, Tennessee, where a 12-year-old girl <laughs> is accused of suffocating her eight-year-old cousin with bedding. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Greg Hurst. I'm Stephanie Skurlock. The district attorney for Gibson County, Frederick A.G., confirms this heartbreaking news which happened Monday. It happened in oh, Humboldt, about two hours northeast of Memphis. Investigators say they received surveillance video from a home security camera capturing the killing. The video shows a 12-year-old girl using the bedding to suffocate her eight-year-old cousin while she was asleep on the top bunk of the beds they shared. Afterwards, we're told the girl cleaned up the victim and repositioned her body. Humboldt police have filed a petition of delinquency charging the tween with first degree murder and tampering with evidence. District mm-hmm. Attorney AG's office is petitioning juvenile judge Mark Johnson to transfer the delinquent child to circuit court to be tried as an adult. Neither girl lived in Humboldt. They were just visiting family members. We will continue to follow that story. I got two issues with this and then I'm done talking about it. First issue, why the fuck is they charging this 12-year-old girl as an adult? Because? I'm going to answer it for y'all. It's because she's black. Number two, this is why I don't let my kids go. No fucking where without me. Unless they're going to my mama house. That is crazy, bro. I want to double back on that first question. Mm-hmm. That's premeditated murder. Yeah. Yeah. That's what that. That's was. why they want to charge her as an adult because you knew what you was doing. This wasn't a, an act of passion. Like, oh, I was so mad. I just, I didn't think she was gonna yeah. die. This was, I killed moment. that bitch. Mm-hmm. I made it look like she fell. Asleep. She died in her sleep, she, and she, that was my iPhone. True, it was bro, on a, but no, but yeah, 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 bro. And if it was a crazy ass yeah, white yeah. boy, they would try to yeah, blame on mental health and all this that's other true. shit to get now, him out. They were in a on now, a. That's they were true. on a a bunk bed. That's true. They were on a bunk bed, and she suffocated her, and then tried to 
proposition the body for like sure. nothing. Right. She's twelve and her brain ain't even developed. I agree with him. Hold on, I, no, I was you, just bro. about to ask that. What is the? Uh, She's twelve and her brain what, ain't what, even developed. The, the age development of a uh, because you know they say women's brain develop a Bastard. little bit. Yeah, I mean, that's you know that's that's, that's, that's myth. They also said old. tornadoes wouldn't come to date either. I don't know <laughs> anymore, bro. Yeah. They said they said they said milk can make you strong. Right, now you hey, now your bones hey, breaking hey, twenty years hey, later. Well, I don't know what talk. I don't know what. Hey, 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 white kid, if there was a white kid that premeditatedly made all these motherfucking bombs in his room, they would blame that shit on mental health. Yeah, and let that nigga down there walk free. You got cable? Do you watch the Weed Channel? Do you watch any of them? All right, so let me ask you: Them channels be fucking skating. So what do you think calls for this this situation? What do you What hey, do you think know. is the Like I said I'm in the but, middle no, bro, I, I got a damn near Eight year old My damn self That's what I'm saying So like, Bro I, I, I see so both sides Like you saying like, bro What like, the fuck How so can you, you got a this, point I'm gonna I'm say I'm on the overall Perspective the On the situation phones, Right They addicting This Fact. whole situation Comes from Two things to me Lack of parenting, mm-hmm. true, and what the fuck this kid was watching. To even know how to, to do mind, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Think about what they said this kid does. Now you let's play the, at the average twelve. I we've all been twelve. Yeah, mm-hmm. I was eleven. We was we we've all been twelve, mm-hmm. right? Not and me. we didn't watch movies that have I mean, killings in them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we didn't yeah. probably play cops and robbers and bang, bang. You know what I'm saying? The niggas acted like they was dead. We'd hold our breath for about 20 seconds to try that like we was, you know. <laughs> this little girl premeditated hmm. all these uh, blue bloods. Dexter. All these, them there, every show. Everything in life right now is either a sexual, B, violence. And they push that shit. Mm-hmm. So ain't no telling what this little girl has been watching, has been left to watch. Because a lot of people are left to fend for themselves and they grow up by themselves. So again, lack of parenting, because if the parents was... If, because if the parents was, what you mean? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You All don't right. have no details about cool. the parents. Now, you don't know that. I said okay. it's two things. That- yeah. 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 I would like to play a little game with you, Scrooge. And Say it is called thing. Devil's Advocate with Slim Beasy. Hey. You are now in the hot seat. All right. So Let's everything go. you was just saying, right? Talking uh-huh. about how everything in media is sexualized and violence, right? Bro, we grew up on Grand Theft Auto. I, I wasn't Start really there. Gamer, but I, I it was. It don't matter was because you 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 know about it, right? Facts. Like, bro, what? I watched American Psycho. Facts. Like there was so much violence in the '90s and the early 2000s. I was once 12, and I never thought about killing none of my siblings because they took the game. My point. Or the exactly. TV. That's my point. You so you're proving my point, sir. With that being said, in today's world, what it, what is being it, what is accessible. To a twelve-year-old, we didn't have access to niggas pulling up. I just with that said, is, at, tw- at, at twelve years old, we, even with a parent or both parents or whatever the fuck the case may be, a lot of some of us did end up off on the far deep end. It was one area that slipped through the cracks that was just on the far side. You wasn't no coming back. Mm-hmm. But in today's know. world, yeah, bro, man. they are exposed a lot. They are exposed to a lot more than we were. Nah, bro. When we were gr- bullshit, bro. Nah, we bro. didn't have cell phones. We didn't have YouTube. We didn't have none of that shit, bro. And all these motherfucking kids, everybody got a phone. Everybody on Instagram. Everybody bro, got a Snapchat. You, hey, hey. They saying all type of shit, bro. Somebody phone going crazy. I'm say, I feel like yeah, but, uh, it, was, it was on airplane mode. But look, bro, I just told you we yeah, had the same yeah, shit. We watched scary. the same violence. We had violent entertainment. We had violent mm-hmm. television. That's exactly what I was going to say. So it's like, how can you sit here and, and make that excuse for them? No, that something was wrong with that little girl. 
Fact. Whether she had a medical, mental health, whatever, she needs to so. be medicated because that sounds like a nutcase to me. <laughs> I think uh, so. So again, so again, she's twelve years old. How the fuck she gonna get some treatment if ain't nobody taking her to get treated? Damn, but we, you don't know that. If like, she got medication, who period. the fuck making Screws. sure that she's supposed period. to take medicine? They probably don't know this. From the little bit of the story that I did what? get, no. Cousin. First what? of all, from the little bit of the story that I did get, the twelve-year-old was living. The mom. The daughter that got killed, that was her mom. The 12 year old was a cousin living with the, so the mom took her in. So, like, you don't, we don't know more details about her parenting and everything for, for you to say that. It was on bunk beds. Hey. And kids do get jealous about video games. There, it's stories back then when, when kids was trying to hurt other motherfucking kids because they had some that they didn't, that, uh, they didn't have at home. It, it's that stories that out there. Yeah. I didn't say it's stories out what there. What they did. And I watched again, my son. I watched my son smack the fuck out of a goddamn kid over him losing a video game, and I had to whoop his behind. That's an anger management problem, and and, and, and I corrected it, but I'm saying. Ooh, hold on. Mental health, too. Just put my point. Mental health, too. But that meant that girl probably had mental health issues. You did what? You did what? You corrected him. You did what? And you are what? Okay, but you still don't no, know ma'am. the details no. about her parenting to judge her. Anything dad, outside right? of the story is only assumption. Okay. Yeah, true enough. True enough. But knowing, okay, so her being a cousin, the auntie coming in, if there is an issue, trust and believe me, this auntie is not no fucking, uh, uh, I'm sure she was in a far distance. They just found her. You don't hey, know yet. You are the last uh, relative or whatever. Or Are you willing to take your niece? I'm sure she know about if there's any issues. All right, and then here's one more thing to take into account. If she ain't get diagnosed, how can she know? Come on, man. They gonna question you. If somebody don't get diagnosed with something. One mic, one mic. They they had to have questioned her once that they took her in for questioning once the crime was committed. You don't think... I feel like she has no remorse in the crime. That's why they're like, man, you know what? We need to lock your ass up for a long time. Now, y'all might be saying, you know what? Let me make... It's in Tennessee. And you know Tennessee? Yeah. It's, it's still... That's where, that's where Brianna, 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 Brianna got killed up. She Not might out get, Kentucky. Kentucky. She might get locked up in a oh, mental... Was, mental. Yeah, we I don't know. We got to yeah, wait it yeah, out. Yeah, they, and I, and that's what I'm saying. Right, Hopefully, yeah. they don't get Who? to charge her as an adult. But hopefully she gets the help because I feel like she. she oh, like, she, but she let's be honest, too, Beasy. If she if, might wake if up it was at sixteen, like damn, I can't believe I killed my cousin. Nah, for real. If she get rehab, uh, rehabilitated, but let's I don't just say know what was going through my mind. If the parent was a problem, come on now, they would have got child neglect. Niche for sure. They would have got child neglect sure. if the parent was the problem as well. This sounds like so we a don't freak know, thing, Scrooge. like you know yo. Your siblings just staying the night with each other, and then you woke up and yeah, didn't it say she it tried time? to dress it up like, oh, she died in her sleep. Yeah, that's she did. Mm. No, no, baby. She did. What are you watching? She popped the body and everything. What are you watching? You ain't. You don't just fathom this. You don't. At twelve, you're not just thinking that shit, bro. Trying to cover. Kids mimic shit. What is she watching? What is she having access to? That ain't no difference than spilling the milk out the cereal and trying to hide it under a towel or something. It is a lot. It could be mental. Mm. It's possible. That's what I ain't I'm saying, saying that it ain't. Psst. All I was saying I is dead people. that's almost like <laughs> she's only twelve, Man. and they on her. They trying to bound her over as an adult. As an adult, she's not even close to fifteen. Yeah, I was just about to say I can see if she was like fourteen, fifteen. Well, that don't a, even that's matter. Different. Shit, I was fifteen. I was bound over and charged as an adult. That's what I'm saying. But this is 15, what a, mentally bro, about you a 12, different bro. at fifteen it's three and years 12. difference. Go ahead, Nino. This is what I'm gonna say. I've been a kid before, and I've done a lot of shit that had absolutely nothing to do with nobody else's influence, you nothing I seen on TV. I was just somebody? a kid being a kid. No. Wow. But, all right, this is an example. So mm-hmm. I was like five or six. My brother, he left his lighter in my uh, in my room, my older brother James. He ain't shit. Um, Fuck James. Ain't shit. James. For sure. <laughs> but... um. <laughs> My sister-in-law, my cousin, and my aunt was downstairs. I'm upstairs fucking with his lighter, lighting the little strings off of the uh, off of the bed sheet. You know how I got them loose strings? Mm-hmm. Lighting the fire, putting it out. Uh, lighting the fire, putting, putting it out. out. <laughs> lighting the fire, think I put it out. They called my name. Mm. The fire then bled up into the actual sheet. Now my bed's on fire. Damn. Damn. Nigga, I didn't see nobody playing with no lighters. 
I ain't see nobody burning the strings off of a. Sometimes <laughs> you just a kid and you don't need an influence to do some shit that mm-hmm. you normally wouldn't do. That's real shit. Hey, that's so it man. it don't gotta necessarily be something that you watch on TV or something that you seen somebody else do or something that the the fucking something on YouTube. So you did it on purpose. Sometimes, no. Did you I mean the same story? Because I'm I'm wondering. I'm, <laughs> no, what I'm saying is me playing with a lighter, there was no there was no influence for me to do that. I just did it because I wanted to do I was just you That's feel what me? he was doing that. Nobody day. put him up to but, it. Yeah, yeah, but he yeah. said sometimes it don't take an influence. That's why I'm like, That's what I'm sure saying. he didn't do it on purpose. Because he said what? Nobody, <laughs> No, I used the lighter on purpose. I didn't set the bed on fire on purpose. The bed ain't the story, it's the fact that I was doing some shit that I normally wouldn't do with no influence. I used to be a firebug, so me too. Me too. What did you do that for? All right, man. I did it because I was I was into the flame. I used to like the. All right, this is my last one. I want to talk. What's up? First time over. All right, this is my last topic before we get out of here, man. This is Big Sean. Kanye gave me the worst deal ever and owes me over six million. Every time I went to try to look at that shit, all my record doing said this is a. Record deal. When you say management, you're not saying Rock Nation? Yeah, I'm saying Rock Nation. Okay. okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. I'm saying Jay Brown. Mm-hmm. Said it was wow. the worst deal he'd ever seen. Wow. Oh. And this man, I had to spend my own money auditing my label because millions of dollars are missing, and you can tell when millions of dollars are missing. Oh, of course. Right? Yes. You should be. I, I spent hundreds of thousands of dollars on my label mm-hmm. thinking Universal owed me this money, and the money had been paid to good music. So let me ask you before we finish. No, let me ask you, bro. Yeah. If somebody owed you five hundred thousand dollars, how would you feel? I would feel. And they was up a hundred million. How would yeah, you feel? Crazy. How, what if they owed you a million? Yeah. What if they owed you three million? Right. Okay. What if they owed you five million dollars? Right. What if they owed you six? And, and no, listen, listen. Okay. What if they owed you that, bro? Right. I understand. And you showed up for them and you did all these things, right? Right. And they up billions. Right. My manager saw my record deal and said, "This is a." record deal when you say management you're not saying rock nation all right did anybody else know this yeah i, I went i, I went. seen I the drink champs the interview yeah. okay i didn't know the extent of how but she was getting no vaseline how often have we talked about read your paperwork has somebody properly read your paperwork like whose fault is that that you decided to sign your your soul away for whatever you got out of it the same paperwork. Hey, bro, you sound like a Kanye fan right now. Why no, Kanye? I sound like <laughs> Why a smart nigga. Yeah. That nigga is I sound like a smart guy. No, I sound like somebody that knows that I've seen how history repeats Pizza itself. Exactly. Yeah. How many years have we heard about a motherfucker okay. getting Fuck. fucking done dirty? And they, the first thing they say is, "I should have read the paperwork. Okay. I was True too enough. thirsty to get out the hood. The True money enough. looked too good. Ben I should have did that." that. <laughs> but that's cool but wait you gonna wait for it to be my turn and i'm gonna do the same shit i watch all the people i love tell me where they fucked okay. up at you don't think i know what happened to tlc nino all the bad boys huh? Twin. Huh? Huh? bad boy <laughs> Huh? Nah, what? Why did you get that man in six m's? Fuck because him in, in the paperwork i didn't have to I'm gonna say Rock Nation Ta-da. was supposed to get in there. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what you... Big Sean said he Nation was blessed. Was to... No, was Rock Nation, Nation was supposed to sign it to the label that you're signed to, and they're supposed to distribute the money to you. That's why when niggas be like, you signed to a nigga that signed to a nigga that signed to a nigga. Uh-huh. That check get to three, four times before it touch your account. And 360 deal. Time. Mm-hmm. Nigga, and you, told, you so thirsty to get some money, you ain't even reading the fine print. Nice. Call us if this caused diarrhea, heart attacks. <laughs> <laughs> the same contract, <laughs> the same contract that, that your manager yeah. now talking about this is a shitty deal. Nigga, it's the same contract from back then. Yeah. So why you ain't have a nigga look at it back then? They thirsty. They thirsty for that little money on the it. Because him and Kanye was buddy buddy. Jay was like, man, it's the best deal you ever going to get, got you, bro. I love Selling you. Selling your soul. Right. I, I love you, bro. And if I'd have been him, he would have been like, yeah, I love you. I'm like, yeah, I love you too. My my lawyer highlighted in green the shit that we had that we want revised. We're going to send that to you tomorrow in your email. Mm-hmm. I love you though, gang. Selling your soul <laughs> like Charleston White. <laughs> Charleston got his soul. <laughs> <laughs> throw that back in the air. 
He lost the eye, not a soul. <laughs> he lost the yeah, lost the eye. <laughs> Just like that one dude, that Houston nigga. That I like that. Hey, yeah, lost you know the they eye. said that's Fetty Wap for real. Oh, that's conspiracy though. Don't get me started. <laughs> but, and listen, uh-huh. this has been an experience for me. Great pop, man. I had yes. a great Burn. time. Hey, I you like were arguing a great with y'all. B, bro. Sure, Seriously, sure, I made a great sure. decision calling you up here, bro. Man, shout out to the <laughs> both of us. Hey. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. That's I what's respect up. it. Yeah, that part. <laughs> what we got going on this weekend, gang? Y'all doing anything worth talking about? Mm. I think so. I just can't remember right now. Boy. Chilling with my buddy Nathan. I know that's right. <laughs> shit. I'm but shit. To think. I feel like I had something. You too. I just can't remember. Shit, I'm going to say, matter. if it ain't nothing but slaving and behaving, we're going to get to swinging. Nah. Y'all got some music y'all want to go out to? <sighs> well, now, that was a great time to ask. <laughs> right. <laughs> but you know what? I got something for oh you. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, man. Oh, my Keep God. The conversation. Yeah. Keep the conversation yeah. going for you. while like I, I send something, something through. Like to hear it? Here you go. <laughs> hey, um, looking asses. Movies. TV. Anything new? Uh, that college football fire. Oops. Okay, so, so shout okay. out. Okay. Like you got it. So, I got it. What you talking about? You ain't coming. Got your head tapped. That is crazy. Hey man, what? I'm still trying to man. I, I you get, like, had it way before me. I'm still getting my hey, feet, man. I just got a championship with UD before I got here, man. Oh my. Hey. God. <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey this this got, nigga, uh, man. After four he years, I, shit I got UD after team builder. Yeah, the University yeah. of Dayton at oh, Welcome man. Stadium. Somebody did. You did football, Lord have mercy. Hey, we just won the championship, oh, man. Nobody I, played after Call of four Duty. Long nobody played Call of Duty. Yeah, we just waiting on. I don't uh, own the game, so like I can't What'd relate you say to none of this shit. Be on the game, but they, they relegated Central mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. I don't even think UD got I a football team. I would have tried to go with Central they do. State. Life. I will they do. They dominate every year, but they're just in a real low division. Then I think you niggas cap. Damn. Hey, let's go to a game. I'm with, I'm with all that. UD. Y'all niggas going to the game? Can I go? Yeah. Why? Well, well, look, you? if you go, you can't be in that motherfucker. Where does the body like go without the brain? What the fuck you talking about? What game? A UD game. A UD game. Can we go to a Dayton Dragons game? I'm down. Mm-hmm. I fucked with. We the gotta Dragon hurry up before it's over. I need. To, want me to send this to your messenger? You can play yeah. it off your messenger. I it's think a so. For that shit. I think you Everybody has an. Uh, I know. That's uh, you right. hate. Uh, <laughs> You hate you niggas was hey, not ready. Get, no, I'm not hating. Head. You just niggas was just not ready. Damn. And you the same. I'm Damn. the same. What? Damn. I don't know really what. what. <laughs> don't shit on me. Now. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Don't <laughs> shit on me." <laughs> <laughs> I'm the same one. Uh, Go ahead, Beezy. Come on, man. Get hey, us up out of here, man. Everybody has an opinion. Everybody has a podcast. Mm-hmm. Just not this podcast. When we no, 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 no. Run that back. Run hey, that back. asshole. Run that back. No, Diddy. You know what? Run that back. B man. Mike, you do it for me. Man, listen, man. He don't know either. Y'all stay tuned, man. <laughs> Everybody, hey, listen. This is the unforgettable podcast, man. Everybody got an opinion. Everybody got an asshole. Everybody got a podcast. Just, Just not, not this podcast. podcast. So we gonna stay tuned, man. Everybody look at the camera and tell them motherfuckers when you see them, huh? In, In a, a minute, minute, boy. Take it easy, Ho- bitch. <laughs> That's my twin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bye.